If you're just joining us, the San Diego International Auto Show is now underway. Fox 5 auto expert Nick Miles joins us once again live from the convention center, and now he takes us inside. Hey, Nick. Yeah, I, this is just like a scrum in here. There's loads of people. Uh, this is, of course, the first day. Open at 10 o'clock this morning. Goes all the way through the weekend. All the information at fox5sandiego.com. And you can see all the brand new cars, trucks, and SUVs. All of those ones that were on show at all the big auto shows like L.A. are all here. Of course, this is the big warm-up to the Detroit Auto Show. We're standing actually in the Land Rover booth right now. Check out these uh, Land Rovers. I know that several of the Fox 5 uh, staff have been going, yeah, I want one of these. Uh, Land Rover, actually, big announcement uh, recently. I going to diesel engines with all the diesel scandal going on with VW thought of that's kind of an interesting decision to make but uh, they've chosen that now uh, right behind us over here is uh, Richard Fowler Richard uh, you are Hello, you are, are you? you're the uh, you are, you're the general manager of the European Motor Store Jaguar Sandia, yeah, right? uh, Aston Martin Jaguar and Lotus yes right, so you have big so news at the Jaguar stand huge. Uh, you have brand new Jaguars first of all the one we're standing in front of is the new XE all new XE this particular one is a pre-production are actually going to Mexico, but it's one of a couple in the country right now. And this is sort of Jaguar's hope for the future. The uh, small cylinder, small displacement, high-end luxury cars, and starts around $34,000. Yeah, so. And, it, and it's, it's a new size that sort of go up against the uh, BMW 3 Series, but right. at a much more palatable price. All, yeah. uh, all aluminium, as you and I would well, say. Well, we would say aluminium, wouldn't we? But for those of us on the other side of the pond, which is this side now, right. it's aluminium, I do believe, right? Although I do believe yeah. the steering wheels are on the wrong side of these cars. They are. They're on the left side, not the right side. Uh, this uh, brand new car coming to market sometime in 2016 and by the way I have to show you this I'm gonna show our camera guy this as well Nate uh, when I ever come to uh, an auto show I'm well prepared to represent if you want to have a look at my socks here oh, well there done, you go well you done, <laughs> hold on. Well, I can't show you my jacket inside oh it's for our other brand oh it is all right yeah, uh, no. so so we're all wearing our Union Jack stuff we too uh, let's look at this behind sure. you here this is a new space for Jaguar this is an SUV now Jaguar never done an SUV before uh, it's it's a bit of a departure Jaguar known as a performance car mm. company. SUV is more utility. How's that working out? Well, first of all, Jaguar came up with this idea to compete with the rest of the luxury brands who are just ripping it with uh, SUVs. And candidly, with the baby boomers and the millennials driving the market these days, we needed to come up with something that was sporty, roomy, yet carried the tradition of Jaguar. And this is really the answer to that particular issue. This particular one has an Ingenium diesel motor. As you know, a lot of people are going to diesel technology uh, despite the uh, German offerings, but uh, this is our new Ingenium diesel four-cylinder built in uh, Wolverhampton, the new plant in Wolves. And the interior of this car is just spectacular. And I, mean, I will tell you, you, if you look at the interior of the car, it looks more like a sports car. Ian Callum, yeah. the design team, made it uh, the, the center console much higher. looks much more sporty by the yeah. inside. This blew me away. Starting price of the diesel in this is cheaper than the gas. How much? Forty thousand nine nine five. That's a Jaguar, just over forty thousand dollars, forty-one thousand dollars almost uh, in the brand new Jaguar F-Pace, and the F-Pace coming to the United States later on April, next year. Actually, April, May. You can pre-order them right now uh, through the local dealerships. You go to dealer websites and you can pre-order. And they've got some special incentives: five hundred dollar navigation incentive, and then they'll make your first payment up to eight hundred dollars on anything that's pre-order between now and probably February, I should suggest. And, of course, Jaguar have that brand new program where they'll do your first three years maintenance, yes, is it? Yes, actually, actually uh, five years, it's, it's industry-leading elite care coverage, five years, 60,000, bumper to bumper, all maintenance covered, scheduled maintenance, so right. brilliant. So I'm, uh, I might be in trouble here. I might have to hand my checkbooks back in. All right, guys, uh, a lot going on down at the San Diego International Auto Show. Of course, all that information, you'll find it at fox5sandiego.com. Lots of cars, trucks, and SUVs. Things here are very, very shiny. You might want to bring some shades. Uh, throw it back to you in the studio. Not only fun to look at, Nick, but I think we can smell the new car smell from, uh, from all the way over here. Thank you very much. We appreciate the insight.